El Gentonio here on commentary. Anthony's open challenge is continuing. Obviously, Anthony is one title down. JD Bailey beat him for the world heavyweight. But Anthony's here. He's going to defend his IC Intercontinental Championship tonight. You can imagine his opponent isn't going to be, you know, probably not going to be the best decision to face Joe tonight. He's very, very pissed off that he lost the title. As you would expect him to be, to be honest. Anthony was the first JTW World Heavyweight Champion. He holds that championship very, very close to his heart. Who's his opponent gonna be tonight? Who's his opponent? And it is Bad B. Bad B is actually cashing in his rematch clause tonight for the Intercontinental Championship. He lost it in a false count anywhere match to Joe Anthony. This is his rematch. Will he will he get his championship back? We haven't seen Bad B in a long time here. He missed the JTW war and everything. Bradby hasn't actually been seen since he lost his championship late last year. But that was the last time we saw him. But this championship match is underway. Referee, ring that bell. These two are going to go lock up. No, Bad B with a drop kick straight away starting this match off. And a big shoulder thrust into the corner. Anthony was nearly knocked over. And another one. Uppercut by Bad B. Joe's not going to take any of that. Moves out of the way. Big shot to the back of the head. Illegal move in many sports. Anthony picking him back up now. And a big... Oh, strike to the head of Bad B. And another one to the face. And another one. Chain of strikes by Anthony. Throwing him into the post. Anthony saying you're going to start with a drop kick. Let's start this properly. Nice and traditional. But oh, Bad B went low. Anthony caught him. Now he's got him in a big snap suplex connected by Joe Anthony over the head. Bad B and Joe Anthony always have. Oh, Pele kick connected by Bad B. Straight to the face. And Anthony with a V trigger. These two back and forth like a tennis match. These two are always. Oh, Anthony. Went for the low drop kick. Moved out of the way and a kick to the chest by Bad B. Like I was saying, these two are always going full offense. They always just go full head of steam at each other. And a dr big super kick connected by Bad B. Wow. Cover one, two, and Anthony kicks out on two, trying to put this much away very early on. More punches to the head by Bad B. Anthony starting to get a bit groggy. Bad B may be looking to do a move, and he, oh, he kicked him straight in the head from the seated position. Joe Anthony just got booted straight into the face of his. Oh, spinning back kick. Anthony dodges it. Kick of his own. And a shot to the head. Bad B slipping. Anthony Turner calling him to turn around and a big missile drop kick connected by Anthony. Hitting the hitting the corner again and another drop kick knocks Bad B down. Joe Anthony gonna regain control in this matchup. Trying to get the momentum back on his side and an Enzo Guri connected by Anthony. You heard the slap as that footed Bad B straight in the cheek. And Anthony just pushing Bad B's head with his foot. But Bad B now with the body shots. It's one of the signature moves of Bad B. These multiple body shots. I'm going to go away. Maybe going to... Bad B going to try and get his legs up. And Anthony caught him in a powerbomb position. Joe Anthony with a big... Oh, jackknife powerbomb. Planting Bad B into the center of the ring. Rolling him over. One, two, and oh, Bad B kicked out at two. That powerbomb would have... Put any other man away, but Bad B, not today. Oh, into the ring post again, and an enziguri of his own to the back of the head of Joe Anthony. You can see Anthony visually stunned by that. And another body shot. Bad B may be going for them chain of body shots again. No, with the back elbow to the chest. Oh, and a one-handed bulldog. Anthony's face planted straight into the canvas. 
Abby always tends to target the head a lot in his matches against Joe Anthony. You see multiple DDTs, super, uh, super kicks, etc. What's Babby doing now with a... Oh, big body splash to Anthony. One, two, Joe kicked out. Yes, every match we've ever seen Bad B go against the Giant and he's always focused on trying to knock him out, basically, to the point where he can genuinely no longer stand. More body shots, phenomenal blitz-style combination, and a... Oh, big Famouser! The height Bad B got on that jump, that Famouser, from a standing position, had to knock Anthony down. And once again, it proven... My fact is just proven there. Anthony's head driven straight into the mat. Babby going for a cover. He's wasted too much time. Anthony's going to kick out. There you go. He should have been on that cover straight away. A mistake made by Bad B may cost him. Anthony with a second V-trigger. Bad B still on his feet somehow on a third one. Oh, you see the knee goes straight into the nose of Bad B. That may be it. Bad B is pretty much out on his feet. Anthony bouncing off. And another... Oh, diving single leg high knee to the side of the face of Bad B. Taking him down. Anthony going to pick him up once more. What's he going for? He's got him on the shoulders. GTS maybe. No, Joe Anthony with a variant of an F5 right there. We've never seen him do that before. Joe Anthony swinging him around. A variation of the F5 there by Joe Anthony. Quite impressive move. And oh, Bad B kicks out. Anthony always tries to add new moves to his arsenal in every match. Tries to keep his matches as unpredictable as possible. But for his opponents anyway. Anthony cannot believe that Bad B just kicked out of the at, that F5. What's he going for? Joe Anthony. No way. He's going to hit the people's elbow, ladies and gentlemen. Tribute to Dwayne The Rock Johnson. People's elbow there by Joe Anthony to Bad B. And Bad B is once again out of it. Anthony hitting the robes, going for a centaur. Maybe Bad B jumped up. He's got him in the gangster lock. The gangster lock to Bad B. That sleeper hold variation. He's got him. Is he going to wrap the legs around the arm? If he can get the... Uh, yes, he's got Anthony's arm wrapped around the legs. Anthony's other arm is free to tap. He won't have enough strength to actually pull Bad B off with one arm. Like a spider monkey, Bad B is locked around Joe Anthony, but he's rolling over now. There's only one way Anthony can get out of this, and he may be going for that one way. Going to lift Bad B up onto his back now. Anthony's managed to find a vertical base here, ladies and gentlemen. Bad B's on his back. Anthony's grabbing that one leg of Bad B and just swinging him round. Like a tornado, Bad B just spun out of that move. And another, oh, super kick connected by Bad B. Anthony's rocked. Bad B just positioned him into the corner. What's, what's he thinking here? No, is he going to do it? Bad B going brap, 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 and a coast to coast by Bad B. Bad B went high risk, ladies and gentlemen. High risk, high reward. It paid off the coast to coast work. Anthony once again rocked by Bad B. Bad B wasting too much time here, and a cross body connected. Anthony's head just crushed. One, two, and Joe manages to stay in it. By God, what a match. Bad B's problem is he tends to waste too much time. What's he going for here? Dirty deeds connected. Planted Anthony on his head. Another example of just Bad B attacking the head too. And Anthony manages to stay in it once again. How? How is he staying in this? I mean, we know Joe must be working very differently tonight. He can't afford to lose another championship. He just can't. That might be the end of him. Anthony kicks out again. There's no way that... A chain of strikes by Bad B is going to put the champ away. What's Bad B thinking now though? Maybe calling Anthony back to his feet again. Going for a super kick. Anthony dodges, literally throws himself out of the way. But Bad B caught him in a stunner. Wow, what a stunner by Bad B. Anthony was just sent high into the air. Crashing down on his lower back. But Bad B wasting too much time rolling him over. I doubt that's got the cover. If Bad B was on that cover straight away, he would have been the new Intercontinental Champion. I repeat, if he wasted, he wasted way too much time on that leg drop by Bad B.
Bad B honestly has no clue what to do now. But Bad B honestly do a move and cover straight away. That's the only way to pin the champ. But no. Oh, Anthony sweeped him. Got him. Going for the heel hook maybe. Anthony's got the heel hold. But is he going to get it under his arm? Yes, he does. He's locked in the heel hook. Heel hook locked in. Anthony screaming. Tap. Bad B attacking the leg. And now with a punch to the head. And another. And another. And now Bad B just constantly punching Joe Anthony in the face. Going to take him down. And that's that. Anthony releases the hold, but the damage may already been done to the heel of Bad B. Anthony once again gaining the vertical base, gonna lift up Bad B up to his feet. Maybe going is he going for it? He's got him in that rainmaker hold, going for that ripcord maybe. Ripcord. Knee strike connected by Joe Anthony. He's rocked. Bad B may be out of it. Did you see the way his body just completely flopped to the ground? But what's what's Bad B doing? Calling Anthony over. How dare you disrespect Joe Anthony like that. Telling him to bring it. And that may be your downfall, Bad B. Joe Anthony at World's End connected. Make the cover champ. One, two, three. The champion retains. Joe Anthony is still your JTW Intercontinental Champion. Bad B lost his rematch. I don't believe there's anyone that could currently topple Anthony. Not in this current position. Anthony losing the World Heavyweight Championship has lit a fire inside of him. He may be unbeatable. I dread for JD Bailey in their rematch. Anthony saying he's coming for the big gold, of course. He's gonna get that championship back. What a match. And Anthony making his way backstage. We hope you enjoyed, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Bad B. Calling out to Joe Anthony. What's, what's he thinking here? Well, he's got a microphone. I see you've only got one belt there. Yeah. The other guy that took it. He's an ally of mine. Bad B saying he's an ally of JD Bailey. We want a match together against you and someone else. Bad B and JD Bailey challenging Joe Anthony. They want a tag match, ladies and gentlemen. Anthony grabbing a microphone of his own. Bad B. JD Bailey. You're on. Anthony, no hesitation there. You want it? You got it. Now put up or shut up. Any chance Joe Anthony gets to put his hands on JD Bailey, he will take. There's just one rule. Put a tag match. What's, what's Bad B getting at? Tornado, Tornado tag. tag. Be on the street. Bad B wants yeah, a, a false count anywhere tornado tag match with Joe Anthony. Are you sure you wanna go against us? Be careful what you wish for. And it is on, ladies and gents, but you've just lost your match against Joe Anthony for the Intercontinental Championship. However, I'm not here to talk to you about that. I'm here to talk to you about the proposal you made to Joe at the end of the match. Interviewer trying to get the word with J D Bailey. Were you Bad the B. one that organized the attack on Joe Anthony? Good question. No comment. Wow. Can you be more guilty than that? Who's your tag partner going to be? I mean, I think it's pretty clear at the moment. I've got to go with my greatest rival and my greatest ally. We've been to hell with each other a million times. Mm. But he's always had my back. Ladies and gents, JD Bailey and Bad B are going to get attacked head on by Joe Anthony and Zach Rowe. You heard it here first, ladies and gents. Yeah, I was just wondering, do you think that Bad B is responsible for JD Bailey's attack? Well, I mean, I've just seen his interview and he said no comment, so can you even be more guilty than that? Okay, thank you, Joe. And one last thing about Bad B. Bad B wasn't there in the JTW war. So That's me and fact. Zach went head to head with YBW and I was expecting Bad B to be there but he wasn't. Anthony talking truth. I don't know what he's got against me but if he has something against me he better say it or I'm going to beat it out of court. Oh and Bad B just jumping Joe Anthony in the backstage interview area. No. Ah. No. Ah. 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 
Oh, Bad B just blindsided Joe Anthony. For no reason. Anthony's feeling that after a hard-fought match. But we will see you in the next episode, ladies and gents, with the Tornado Tag Match. Okay.